is a brief overview of the new extension for the Client Document Manager. The AES Security Encryption extension provides a way to encrypt data at rest, which basically means it takes the file you uploaded, encrypts it, so if anyone got access to the file, it would be nothing but useless corrupted data. AES, or as it's called the Raindell Cipher, is trusted by financial institutions as well as the leading method of encryption for government data. So when the plugin is activated, you'll notice a new option under Settings called Security Tools. This allows you to change the alternate uploads folder. Um, we recommend making that a folder that is not viewable by public so nobody can access your files. The files will be uh, encrypted, but you still don't want anybody to have access to them. Uh, the plugin also enables forced login, so the user has to log in to download a file. And it also disables JavaScript redirects. Um, you have the option to force the system to encrypt all new files or give the user the option to encrypt a file. Um, if you check this box right here, they will, the user will not be asked at file upload. Um, let's go to the file uploader. Okay, now let's upload a file. Uh, click the add file button. Choose your file. And if you want to encrypt the file, check this box right here and then start upload. And this uploaded our encrypted file here, which doesn't have a thumbnail uh, because the data is encrypted. Um, since we're not forcing encryption, we do have the op option here to decrypt the file. Uh, if you didn't want that file encrypted anymore, just clicking it simply decrypts it. And you can see the thumbnail again and you can go back and forth. Another feature we give you is a tool to encrypt or de decrypt all your files on your site. So if you want to encrypt all existing files, you would choose encrypt all files and click start. Uh, it, would, it would go through and encrypt every single file. So now when you go into your file area, You notice all the files are encrypted. And you can unencrypt them. And you notice all the files are decrypted again. Uh, this is useful if you have a bunch of files left over 